So I played Doris, who's um, a sort of working class London shop girl. Um, so she's a, she's a double act with a character called Kitty. Um, and I mean, we don't know exactly, but they, they knew each other before they started. Um, and they sort of went for the job interview together, both got the job. Um, and we're sort of like the Greek chorus, we're always in the background, we comment on everything. Um, we're sort of, we're quite bitchy and giggly and, and, and as, as the, you don't really know much about us personally, but as, as, the, as the series goes on you'll get to know us more and our characters sort of get bigger and you get to know a bit more about our home lives. And Did you, were you surprised by anything about the life of the shop girl in that period? Did you find out things that you didn't know about? Um, well, there's the there's the thing that if you're you're married, you can't you can't work. Um, so that was quite interesting to find out. I mean, I worked in retail for years, so luckily it came very natural to me, standing behind counters doing nothing, folding up stuff. <laughs> um, but uh, we we only work in um, accessories, and um, there's only so many times you can fold the same glove and make, <laughs> and make yourself look busy. Well, I actually left EastEnders three and a half years ago, so it wasn't <laughs> wasn't that recent. Um, but it's very different. It's nice to sort of go from uh, uh, I don't know. A, a sort of long-running uh, institution that everyone knows about to something brand new um, and of course a hundred years previous and the costumes and the characters very different um, but we were just saying it's quite weird doing press for something because normally you've finished it and you leave it six months and then you talk about it but obviously with, with EastEnders and, and soaps and stuff you're, you're always filming and interviewing so so it's not as strange for me as it is for you. No, this is the first time I've ever ever started sort of doing press on something that I haven't finished because normally you kind of forget about it and then you think oh well oh yeah no I forgot I did that and then you sort of start up but I've got to go to set this afternoon to shoot some of the end. <laughs>